now we are going to have a demonstration of rf cautery radio frequency cautery which is manufactured by girish surgical works mumbai maharashtra this machine is manufactured and it is done into abs plastic body which is shock proof with this rf cautery machine we will be giving you the accessories in which there will be a single pedal plastic abs material single pedal foot switch there will be a hand switch pencil with three pin adapter and in that there will be cutting and coagulation button two buttons will be there yellow and blue the main cord there will be a steel stainless steel patient plate earthing plate and optional if you want we will be giving you a silicon rubber pad one patient plate cable cord bipolar cable cord active handle with cable cord tip cleaner electrodes for hand switch set of 15 electrodes for active handle set of 4 electrode for active handle one pen holder one bipolar forceps in this rf cautery you can keep it like this at a platform or you can put it on the legs also your two legs are there foldable this way you can use now we'll see this is the intensity knob to increase the intensity here is the high cutting upwards if you press it downwards it will go into the low cutting and suppose if it is in center then the machine will not work it will show that the machine is dead it is it will not give any activity so it should not be in center center means it will be completely dead so either if you want to go into high cutting you have to turn it upwards and center it is dead if you press it down it will go into the low cutting so this is the switch for high cutting and low cutting now if you are using a foot switch then it will you have to put it upwards like this so it will go into the foot switch mode center it will be dead and when you are using hand switch you have to go into the hand switch mode you have to press it completely down and center again it will be dead this is the light indicator when you press the foot switch this light will glow this part this window is for intensity when you increase the intensity 1 to 6 it will show you here this is the patient plate port here you have to insert the patient plate cable cord this is for the bipolar bipolar jack pin two jack pin will be going into this this is for active handle when you are using a foot control here the active handle jack pin you have to insert this is for the hand switch which is cutting and coagulation the three pin hand switch connection you have to give it here now we are going to connect patient plate cable cord to the machine here is one single jack pin and the other end there will be one single jack pin this jack pin will be going to this port patient plate and the other will be going to patient plate here is a hole you have to insert it like this now bipolar in this bipolar two banana jack pins will be there it will be going to bipolar connection like this and this is the bipolar forceps tweezer you have to insert the bipolar forceps into this cable cord now we are going to see how the active handle is been used you have to open only two thread of this then this electrode whichever is 
used according to your requirement you have to insert it here and you have to tight it again so this electrode won't come out so this is the active handle and this active handle jack pin will be going to the active handle port hand switch pencil in this hand switch pencil you will be getting three pins in this you can see the two pins are there which is little close and one is little far according to this the same holes are there into the port of hand switch one is far and two are close so according to that you have to insert it into the machine behind the machine there is a foot switch connection the main score connection and this is on off switch this is main score this three pin will be going to the electric connection main board and this part will be going to mains in the machine you will be getting a foot switch male connection and with the foot switch will be giving you a connector here a small slot is there the same connection you have to match here and you have to insert the foot switch and tighten this Now we'll put on the machine. Here you, the window will indicate one that the machine is on one output. One, two, three. As you increase the intensity, it will go to six. The output of the machine will increase. Now we'll check the machine how it works. We have took a soap. We'll make it little wet. We have put a plain water. Now we are going to check the machine. First, we'll operate the hand switch. We'll check the hand switch pencil how it works. In center, it is dead as I told you. And if you go upwards, it is high. In center, dead again. And low, the low current you'll get. Now we are trying the hand switch pencil, so we have to go on to the hand switch mode downwards. Now, now we will see the button is into the center, both the buttons are into the center, so it is dead. So we will go to the high cutting and for the hand switch pencil as we are working, so we have to go on to the hand switch mode. This is intensity 2, we will try it on 1. In one intensity, you will be getting a very low output. It's two, three, this is three. I am trying it both, huh? even the cutting and the coagulation both button I am trying it. This is the cutting one and this is for the coagulation. I will go to the 4 output. File. Six. So this is how the hand switch pencil is worked. Now we'll go to the second one, that is foot control one. Now we'll put this banana jack pin to the active handle connection. This is important, as I told you, when you have to insert the electrode into this you have to open little and you have to insert the electrode into this you have to tight it so it will not move and when you want to remove the electrode you have to open it again and pull it out so now i am trying it 
on the soap now again okay. i'll be operating with the foot switch now so you have to go on to the foot switch mode center is dead again you have to press it upward strictly for the foot switch otherwise the machine will not work now this is the foot switch i'm showing you with the hand because you have to know that and when i press it is working so basically you have to use it with the foot not with the hand this is only for the demonstration purpose so we'll check it out the intensity is on one so we'll try this it is on one we'll increase the output three four five now when you use the electrode here the moisture comes so you with that we had given you a tip cleaner this is a scrubber you have to clean this electrode onto this because when the moisture comes onto that night it will not show you that satisfaction output so you have to keep on cleaning this electrode so it will be clean and you can use it properly With this we are giving you the 15 electrodes, you can use it according to your requirement, what surgery you are doing and also we are giving you the 4 special electrode which can be used into the hand switch. With, with the hand switch there will be a basic electrode they will be giving you. So this you can remove and you can use this electrode into this, what we are giving the 4 electrode. You can use it according to your requirement, like this, we will operate and we will see. This is the loop what we had tried it on the soap. Now we will try it on banana. In there we will be giving you the set of 4 electrodes. Even this you can use. Total there will be 19 electrodes which you can use it according to your requirement so as i told you you have to open this insert the electrode tight it now we have to try it on the foot switch so this will be going onto the foot switch mode we'll try it on banana This I am doing non-touch. Now we are going to see the bipolar feature how it works. So this is the bipolar four slips. You have to go it onto the foot switch. Two banana jack pins are connected to the bipolar port. With the foot control, you have to operate the bipolar. This analog intensity mode you will get it on one. On one. This is two. Three. Four. This is five. So this is how the bipolar will work. With the machine we will be giving you a pen holder, you have to put a double tape here and on the machine wherever you want to put it, you can put it like this. So this will work as a pen holder. 